a new parabola called rectangular hyperbola. Now, if you take x square by a square minus y square by b square equal to 1, which is standard equation of hyperbola with eccentricity square root of a square plus b square by a square. By chance, if a is equal to b, then this equation reduces to x square by a square minus y square by a square equal to 1. That is, x square minus y square equal to a square. This is called rectangular hyperbola. So, if the length of transverse axis is equal to length of conjugate axis, then the hyperbola is called rectangular hyperbola. Further, if you take eccentricity square root of a square plus a square by a square, square root of 2a square by a square root 2 greater than 1. We know that hyperbola eccentricity must be more than 1. In case of ellipse it is 0 to 1 and in case of parabola it is equal to 1. Now, let us consider tangent and normal, tangent and normal at a point p x1 comma y1. Now, let us consider x square by a square minus y square by b square equal to 1. This is standard hyperbola. So, differentiate 2x by a square minus 2y by b square dy by dx is equal to 0. 2 gets cancelled minus y by b square dy by dx is equal to minus x by a square negative sign cancels. So, dy by dx is equal to b square x by a square y. So, at the point x1 comma y1 it is b square x1 by a square y1. Let us write equation of tangent is y minus y1 is equal to b square x1 by a square y1 into x minus x1. Now, simplify this is a square into y y1 minus a square y1 square is equal to x x1 b square x x1 b square minus x1 square this is b square. Now, bring x1 square b square to LHS time and y y1 to RHS part that will become x x1 b square minus y y1 a square is equal to this is x1 square b square minus y1 square a square. Now, dividing throughout by a square b square, dividing throughout by throughout by a square b square, we will get x x1 by a square minus y y1 by b square equal to x1 square by a square y1 square by b square. No doubt we can write x x1 by a square minus y y1 by b square minus 1 is equal to x1 square by a square minus y1 square by b square minus 1. According to notations, this is S1, this is S11. So, this is S1 and S11. Since the point lies on the curve, S11 is equal to 0. So, that is why S1 equal to 0 is the equation of tangent at the point P x1, y1. Now, let us write equation of normal. So, what is equation of normal? Y minus y1 equal to observe slope of tangent is b square x1 by a square y1. So, slope of normal will be negative of its reciprocal minus it is a square y1 by b square x1 into x minus x1. Now, cross multiplication x1 y b square minus x1 y1 b square equal to x y1 minus a square plus x1 y1 it is a square. Now, bring x y1 to the LHS part, this x1 y1 to the RHS part. So, we will get this is x y1 a square x1 y b square is equal to x1 y1 into a square plus b square. Now, divide throughout by x1 y1 dividing throughout by 
x1 comma y1 what do you get now a square x by x1 plus b square y by y1 is equal to a square plus b square now you have seen in case of ellipse you are having minus here also minus in case of hyperbola it is plus so the difference between ellipse and hyperbola is wherever b square is there write minus b square ellipse changes to hyperbola